hi welcome to the mathematics in my channel today we are going to solve another interesting fractional differentiation question okay how to find half derivative of x square mm, first I'm going to take the general case mm, d by dx ah, before it we know uh, this notation we can write d one half x square this is also equal to half derivative of x square okay first I'm going to take d by dx x to the k power and we know the general power rule of differentiation so k times x to the k minus 1 and we can write this is equal to k factorial over k minus 1 factorial x to the k minus 1. Now k factorial we know k times k minus 1 factorial and k minus 1 factorial get cancelled. So this is equal to k times x to the k minus 1. Okay now I am going to take second derivative of x to the k. So, d square over dx square x to the k is equal to, now we know here k, now k minus 1, sorry, now k minus 1 x to the k minus 2 and we can write this is equal to k factorial over k minus 2 factorial x to the k minus 2 again we can differentiation so third derivative of x to the k power we can write this is equal to k k minus 1 now according to power rule k minus 2 x to the k minus 3 and we can write this is equal to k factorial over k minus 3 factorial x to the k minus 3 now according to this pattern we can write nth derivative of x to the k is equal to now here k factorial so here also k factorial over now third derivative x k minus 3 now second derivative k minus 2 so n derivative we know k minus n factorial times x to the here k minus 3 so k minus n okay now we can uh, write this equation by using sorry uh, by using gamma function so we can write d to the n power over dx to the n power x to the k is equal to now k factorial we know gamma of k plus 1 over k minus n factorial gamma of k minus n plus 1 times here x to the k minus n okay this is the general formula for fractional differentiation okay now uh, I'm going to check this formula by using our traditional differentiation so we all know d by dx x to the third power here for a example uh, this is equal to according to general power rule traditional differentiation 3 times x square ok now we can use this formula so now uh, first derivative so now n is equal to 1 so d by dx 
x to the third power is equal to gamma of k plus 1. So, gamma of, now k is equal to 3, so gamma of 4 over gamma of k minus n plus 1. So, we know here gamma of 3 x to the 2 minus now sorry 3 minus 1 now gamma of 4 we know 3 factorial or gamma of 3 2 factorial x square and 2 factorial get cancelled and we will have 3 times x square ok we know this is the answer of the uh, derivative of x to the third power so same answer okay now we can take the half derivative of half derivative of x square so we can write now gamma of k plus 1 now k is equal to 2 so gamma of here 3 over gamma of now k minus n plus 1 so k is equal to 2 minus n is equal to 1 half <coughs> plus 1 times x to the k minus n so k is equal to n is equal to 1 half so 2 minus 1 half ok now gamma of 3 we know 2 factorial over here if we simplify this 2 plus 1 3 3 minus 1 half so 2 times 1 half so for gamma of 5 over 2 here x to the 2 minus 1 half so 3 over 2 then 2 factorial we know 1 sorry 2 gamma of 5 over 2 we know 3 times the square root of 5 over 4 here x to the 3 over 2 ok now we can write this is equal to 4 times 2 8 over 3 times the square root of 5 x to the 3 over 2 ok this is the half derivative of x square also we know d 1 half over dx to the 1 half d 1 half over dx to the 1 half times d 1 half over dx to the 1 half x square <coughs> sorry and this is equal to now 1 half 1 half so full derivative so first derivative of x square ok now we can check so d 1 half over dx to the 1 half and we found half derivative of x square we know 8 over 3 times square root of pi times x to the 3 over 2 and now we can write this is equal to now 8 over 3 times the square root of 5 is a constant so 8 over 3 times the square root of 5 d 1 half over dx to the 1 half x to the 3 over 2 and here 8 over 3 times the square root of 5 now half derivative of <coughs> x to the 3 over 2 so we can apply general formula so here gamma of k plus 1 so 3 over 2 plus 1 over gamma of k minus n plus 1 so 3 over 2 plus 1 half plus 1 here sorry here minus and here x to the 3 over 2 minus 1 half and now 
we can write here 8 over 3 times the square root of 5 here gamma of 5 over 2 over gamma of here uh, gamma of 2 x to the 3 over 2 minus 1 half so x and now here 8 over 3 times square root of 5 gamma of 5 over 2 so 3 times square root of 5 over uh, gamma of 4 and here x gamma of 2 we know 1 factorial so 1 now this term get cancelled 4 times 2 so this is equal to 2 times x okay now we know this is true okay if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching